Kia ora, greetings, Annalise here. I would like to discuss today a new way of being and a new way of existing that I'm seeing coming through. Um, it is, it challenges me personally because it challenges the status quo, um, but it's a very feminine way. Um, and as I talk about it, I'm sure that there is, um, there is a, a young aspect that goes with this very yin, feminine um, way of being. Um, but first and foremost, let's just talk through what, what I'm seeing is it's uh, moving from a place of inspiration. So last year when I was very ill, um, I had chronic anemia, which meant that I couldn't move. I literally was out. But now and then there would be something that would arise in me, some motivation to do something, and I would do it, and I would have just enough energy to do it. And I would then have to return to my that very calm state. Um, and then I would watch how that repercussion would come around from that action. And I see that as working on a very cyclical um, timeline. And to be able to work from our inspiration and um, what lives, honouring what lives in the moment, we have to be one very present with ourselves, embodied, so we can hear and feel what that what that heart felt yes is to to something, um, and then we have to trust. It's calling in a, a big degree of trust, and I think trust has been a, a a key um, attribute that's come through, that's coming through more and more again, is that we have to trust completely in whatever it is that we have to trust in. But then in, in the respects of this living in this cyclical nature, when we're working on a, on a linear timeline, we know that this action will take us closer to this outcome. When we're working cyclically, and through uh, inspiration, we're working on a spiral. And this action may not have any repercussions, depending on where it's at in the spiral, for some time. So hence, from this point, this action needs a great deal of trust until it comes back to here, and it always does. And I, from my, ex my experience of working on this spiral, that there's actually, you know, biggest spirals within spirals, there's a ginormous spiral of my life that's happening, and then there's the spirals that go with the moon, then there's the spirals that go with the day, and the spirals that probably, probably all have a heavenly body, at, um, a heavenly body alignment, um, because the, these are the greatest cycles. Yeah, anyway, so that's, um, that's what I'm working with at the moment, and it's what I'm seeing happening, and it seems to be a very incredible, incredibly beautiful uh, thing, if we can allow ourselves to trust and be brave and step into it, because it's different, it's a different way of being in the world, so yeah, I, I wonder if that resonated with you, if that resonated with you, let me know. Let me know what's going on for you and how that is, how that is landing. Uh, yeah, and how um, inspiration lands in your body. What does that look like um, as a dancer, as somebody who embodies inspiration? I, I can feel a very physical yes to things. Um, yeah, so let us know how that's going and may the force be with you. Thanks. Bye.